In this video, we're gonna take a look at the brand new Bing AI app that's now available for your iPhone. And now that Microsoft has made it as an iOS app, all we need to do is just download it. To get started, open the App Store. Once you're in the App Store, just search for Bing. The app that we're gonna be looking for is called Bing Your AI Copilot. Go ahead and find that and then download it. Once Bing finishes downloading, you can then close the App Store and then open the app. The first time that you open it, you're gonna be asked a couple of things. The first is if you wanna allow notifications. Choose allow or don't. After that, it's gonna ask you if you wanna be tracked across your apps. And again, personal preference, choose allow or not. If you're already logged into a Microsoft anywhere on your iPhone, then you're automatically gonna be logged into your Microsoft account and you can hit get started. If not though, you'll be asked to log into your Microsoft account. If you have an account, then you can enter your credentials. If not though, you can tap maybe later on the top right of the page. But to use the full Bing AI, you're gonna need to create and sign into your Microsoft account. Once you're logged in and you're at the main Bing homepage, you can then tap the AI chat icon here at the bottom center. Bing is using ChatGPT, which is developed by OpenAI, as the backbone of their AI. So as of right now, it's the best and the most commonly used artificial intelligence chatbot available. To start a chat, just select the chat icon and then ask a question. This can be anything from trivia to a travel itinerary. You can ask the AI to be more specific, broader, or even give you other options. You can play around in here with the chatbot and get used to how it works. Starting at the top here, you have a couple things that you can try just to sample it out. Under that, they have a preview mode of how conversation styles can be returned to you. You can choose to have the responses more creative, balanced, or precise. You can ask Bing your question using the microphone here in the bottom center, or tap the keyboard on the bottom right and type out your question. After you ask it something like, what should I do in Chicago, we can read the answer, but underneath that, we can also scroll and see the different results that it gives us. If we look at the very bottom underneath the results, it'll give us a few other questions that we can ask that go along with our original one. And to clear your responses and start fresh, just tap the new topic icon here on the bottom left. And that's how you get and use the new ChatGPT-powered Bing AI app on an iPhone.